Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel Learn with Sumi. In this video, we are going to find an angle between the pair of curves and the curves are given as R is equals to A into 1 plus cos theta and R square is equals to A square cos 2 theta. Okay, so uh, we will solve this step by step. First, we'll take log on both sides and before moving on to this uh, problem with this problem, Mm, I would like to know if you understand my explanation very well. If you need any improvements, let me know in the comment section. And if you like this video, do not forget to give the thumbs up and share it with your friends. And main thing is subscribe to my channel so that I'll, get, I'll be motivated to help your people. Okay, and I'll keep on posting more engineering mathematics questions. So I'll get started by taking logs on both sides. So take log on both sides. So it becomes log r is equals to log of a into 1 plus cos theta. Correct? And similarly, we will take log on both sides uh, to the other equation as well. So it becomes log of r square is equals to log of a square cos 2 theta. So if you know the logarithmic expansions, uh, log a into b is nothing but log a plus log b correct and log a power b is nothing but b log a so we will expand this uh, logs and then we'll differentiate this with respect to theta so this is log r no further expansion and log a plus log 1 plus cos theta and here it is 2 log r is equals to this this is like log a into b, log a plus b, plus this is what, nothing but log a to the power b. So, I can write it as 2 log a plus log cos 2 theta. So, the expansion is done. Now, we will move forward with differentiate with respect to theta. Okay, so it becomes 1 by r dr by d theta is equal to differentiation of a constant is 0 plus 1 divided by 1 plus cos theta into minus sine theta okay and this becomes 2 into 1 by r dr by d theta this is also same differentiate with respect to theta okay it becomes is equals to 2 log a is 0 plus 1 divided by cos 2 theta differentiation of cos 2 theta is minus 2 sine 2 theta okay now this becomes cot 5 1 is equals to minus sine theta divided by 1 plus cos theta. This becomes 2 into cot 5 2 is equals to minus 2 sine 2 theta divided by cos 2 theta. Okay. Now I can write if you have watched my previous videos you know I can write this sine theta as nothing but 2 sine theta by 2 and cos theta by 2 and 1 plus cos theta I can write it as cos square theta by 2. I hope it is clear. I hope it is clear. This is 2 cos square theta by 2. Okay, sorry. I forgot to mention this 2 cos 2 in this 2 cos square theta by 2. So, using these expansions, I will write cot 5 1 as minus 2 sine theta by 2 cos theta by 2 divided by, I will expand this cos square theta by 2 and write 2 cos theta by 2 into cos theta by 2 this 2 gets cancelled this 2 gets cancelled 2 and 2 will get cancelled cos theta by 2 and cos theta by 2 will get cancelled so cot phi 1 is nothing but minus sine by cos is tan theta by 2 okay till then we'll go for the differentiation of this as well 2 and 2 will get cancelled so cot phi 2 is nothing but minus tan 2 theta so uh, i can write this in terms of cot like cot of pi by 2 plus this is a minus this is minus so this falls on the second quadrant so this becomes 2 theta so your theta value is 2 theta correct so phi 2 is nothing but pi by 2 plus 2 theta we found the phi 2 now we will find similarly phi 1 so we'll write in terms of cot here so it becomes like pi by 2 plus theta by 2. So, phi 1 is nothing but pi by 2 plus theta by 2. Okay. And now, phi 1 minus phi 2 is nothing but pi by 2 plus theta by 2 minus pi by 2 minus 2 theta. 
So this becomes this and this will get cancelled. This becomes minus 3 theta by 2. So this is nothing but 3 theta by 2. Okay. Now we will find out theta using the pair of curves given in the question. Okay. Pair of curves given in the question. So I will write the pair of curves here on the next page. Okay. R is equals to a into 1 plus cos theta and r square is equals to a square cos 2 theta. So I can write this as r is equals to square root of a square cos 2 theta. Correct? So now this becomes a into 1 plus cos theta is equals to square root of a square cos 2 theta and a into 1 plus cos theta is nothing but a into square root of cos 2 theta. For this for a, the square and square root gets cancelled. Okay, so a and a will get cancelled. 1 plus cos theta is equals to cos 2 theta. So, if you know the trigonometric formula, you will know we can write cos 2 theta, cos 2 theta as 2 cos square theta minus 1. Okay. And one minute, I skipped one step. So, this is square root of cos 2 theta, right? So, I will do square on both sides. So, it becomes 1 plus cos theta. The whole square is equals to cos 2 theta. It becomes like 1 square plus cos square theta plus 2 cos theta is equals to cos 2 theta. You know what is cos? You know what is cos 2 theta, right? Cos 2 theta is this. So, I can write this as 1 plus cos square theta plus 2 cos theta is equals to 2 cos square theta minus 1. I will take this everything to the other side. So, it becomes 2 cos square theta minus cos square theta. Okay. And minus 2 cos theta minus 1 minus 1 is equals to 0. Okay. So, it becomes cos square theta minus 2 cos theta minus 2 equals to 0. So, if you see this, this has become quadratic equation. Correct. So, using the formula, we can find the value of cos theta. That is... That is, I can write it as minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac whole divided by 2a. Correct? If you remember this formula using this, we can do it. So, here what is the value of a? a is 1, b is minus 2 and c is also minus 2. So, minus of minus 2, this is cos theta, right? So, minus of minus 2 plus or minus square root of b square minus 4 into 1 into minus 2. You know this is c divided by 2 into 1. So this becomes plus 2 plus or minus square root of 4 plus 4 to the 8 divided by 2. Correct? So this becomes 2 plus or minus square root of this becomes 12 whole divided by 2. This I can further write it as 2 plus or minus uh, 4 threes are 12 I can do it right. 4 into 3 divided by 2. So 2 I can 4 I can write it as square root of 2. So square root of 2 and this root will get cancelled. So this it will be this is it will become uh, 2 plus or minus 2 square root of 3 divided by 2. Correct? Now, I will write this down in the next paper. So, it will become 2, I will take it common. The 2, I will take it common. So, it will become 1 plus or minus square root of 3 whole divided by 2. So, 2 and 2 will get cancelled. So, cos theta is what? Cos theta is now... 1 plus or minus root 3. But if you know cos theta 
if you know cos theta cannot exceed cannot exceed 1 so as we know that cos theta cannot exceed 1 so cos theta is nothing but 1 minus root 3 so i can write cos theta as 1 minus 2 sin square theta by 2 okay so this is a formula you need to remember so i will write 1 minus 2 sin square theta by 2 is equals to 1 minus root 3 okay so this becomes minus 2 sin square theta by 2 is equals to this becomes minus here minus 1 plus 1 minus root 3 so this will get cancelled so i can write this as like uh, sin square theta by 2 minus and minus will also get cancelled root 3 by this is 2 right so further can i write this as like whole square root of 3 by 4 so if i do square on both side square on both side so it square root on both side square root on both side so it will become sine theta by 2 is equals to this will become this will become 3 by 4 square root is what whole to the power 1 by 2 right power 1 by 2 So, I can write this square root also in the power of 1 by 2. So, sine theta by 2 is equals to 3 by 4 whole to the power 1 by 2 whole to the power 1 by 2. So, this becomes 3 by 4 whole to the power 1 by 4. Correct? Now, I can say, I can say that theta by 2 is nothing but sine inverse of 3 by 4 to the power 1 by 4 right so i can write theta is equals to 2 sine inverse of 3 by 4 whole to the power 1 by 4 correct so now i got the value of theta I got the value of theta. So this, this I will substitute here in this, in this question, okay. So this becomes 5 1 minus 5 2. Don't, you shouldn't get confused with all this, okay. 5 1 minus 5 2 is equals to 3 theta by 2 is equals to 3 into what is theta what is theta we found 2 sine inverse of 3 by 4 whole to the power 1 by 4 correct divided by 2 so this becomes 6 correct 3 2 is a 6 so this becomes 6 or i can cancel this 2 and 2 so 5 1 minus 5 2 becomes 3 sin inverse of 3 by 4 whole to the power 1 by 4. Hence, this is the angle between the pair of curves. Okay? That is R is equals to A into 1 plus cos theta and R square is equals to A square cos 2 theta. Thank you for watching this video.